So although Zanzibar is an island, but uh, about 50 small islands surrounded with uh, Zanzibar. And those include Chumbe Island, where you can find Chumbe Island. It's uh, on the other side of uh, the place where we are. But here you can see Bowie Island, and that is the prison island. The one island prison is island, formerly, yeah, Bowie Island. Yeah, okay. yeah, and that is prison island. Prison Island formerly was owned by Oman Arabs and used as a private place for detention of Greek Cassidian slaves. Mm -hmm. And also the island is approximately half a mile long and white, uh, white one eighth of a mile wide. And also there's a house which was built in 1883 as a central prison here in Zanzibar. But later never utilized the site because by that time there was an Englishman called General Matthew who bought that house to support him prisoners in that island. And after that the island was used as a quarantine section for those who have infectious disease such as smallpox, cholera, dysentery for Zanzibar, Uganda, Kenya and Tanganyika Tang Tang territory. But nowadays the island is very beautiful for bit luxation and snorkeling. But also you find a huge giant turtle like this like, like this side. Yes, All right, uh, we have to, we have to, yeah, let's yeah. take shower, let's take shelter in place. But, uh, let's take shelter in place and we can talk. That island is called uh, Chapani Island or Grave Island? Grave Island. Yeah, what about Snake Island? Snake Island is a small one, around just behind that shop. Yeah, Snake yeah, Island is a yeah. perfect island uh, which your enemy just dropped them off there and let the snake take care of them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, Bay Island, sorry. Uh, Grave Island or... or I mean, Grave Island or... I mean, uh, Bay Island. Uh, it was so called as a Grave Island because uh, due to the First World War. Because here in Zanzibar, we have a big, I mean, a big war here. It was, it was against uh, German and uh, English. But in the long run, British ship has been sucked and uh, it was sunk. And all people who were in that uh, ship were died and then later their body has been collected and then buried in that uh, island. Yeah. It, nowadays you can go in there, you can find a lot of uh, British, uh, I mean, uh, British graveyards and it's still under inspection of Commonwealth. Yeah. Uh -huh. Also there's a hotel. And, a uh, hotel there? On that, on that island? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And uh, you can see a lot of boats. That's the uh, boats we normally use them for the trip to the islands. So any other island, yeah, these boats take yeah, it to? Yeah, yeah. Those uh, islands, those boats around there. Yeah, yeah. And this is a uh, Forozani Cape Town uh, fish market. It's a restaurant. And this is an area where normally during the evening time, many people are coming to cook a variety of food over there. Now they are in I've heard about it. I heard if I come here late at night, they'll have grill, they'll have lobsters, all kind of things. But you yeah. know, we've never been able to come out here at night because usually we leave. Yeah, and I'm, so I'm gonna far. have to do it one day and yeah, find it. Yeah. So like the, all this, like the seafood laid out and yeah, they, yeah. there's grilling it. Yeah. And it's kind of like, you know, you know, yeah, 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 the, yeah, yeah. You know the, 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 the brothers come out there with the, the, the jerk it's chicken and things. And, yeah. and I tell people, those are the kind of street food I'm down with. Yeah. You know, not the. This is a garden and everybody's free to come and relax here. Yeah, and that's the one that's to walk to the garden. Like a garden? I was like, yeah, family, you know? You know kind of like nature there. walk. That's a place we are. I've ate right here too also. Yeah. But you know, once you go to Zanzibar South, um, you, 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 don't, you don't go back to anything else. But um, mango passion. Ridiculous amount of ships, right? Sometimes I wonder how these ships don't collide. So this is a place where they cook. No, what is this right here? The, the floating boat. Bar. That is and the bar as well. That is wicked. So look at that. Isn't yeah. that amazing? Yeah, so yeah, always yeah. if you want to go there, you can book. And then the small boats are coming here. Island life man is the best life man. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. And this is a place where people they cook the food and you can see their preparation. They start to uh, bring the uh, tables around. Oh, here. this is what we're talking about. Let's yeah, check it out. So what time they, what time they open usually like on night? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And also you can see Shawarma here. Also there's a lot of uh, So this uh, so literally this entire little zone right here. Entire little zone right here they're gonna be grilling. Yeah, yeah. It's a nice place during the evening time. So they are on the preparation. I know, I know. There's cannons right here. Where do these cannons? Uh, it's this is a Portuguese gun. Uh, Portuguese gun. Did they find the yeah. British? It's just a sample. Uh, let's take shelter in place. Where's <laughs> that? <laughs> 
So, the family, it is uh, storming. And one thing about Stone uh, Town, it is so tropical. At any moment, it rains. The best break that we had earlier is as soon as we got to dinner, it started pouring down. And please don't have any food out because a cat would eat your food. Oh, you say you eat cats? Virgin ears. <laughs> you right, you right. I said you right. I said you right. I said you I do apologize. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, he, I don't think he's been. No, my son hears worse things than that every day from me. <laughs> like sometimes, yeah. We've been. Uh, oh, man. Kids got their own mind, man. Everybody's got their own mind. Yeah, they got their own mind. You better. So, sometimes I look at these cats, I'm like, you better be happy that you're not close to a Chinese restaurant. You'll be the next little right. set up a dinner. <laughs> They sell, they sell pokey bowls here. What are the pokey bowls? It's something like a Japanese or Hawaiian thing. Yeah, I remember eating out here one time. That was not bad. All of that food. Yeah, we have to take shelter in place oh, yeah. and stay under these tents. Uh, but this is uh, you know, showing you the ocean side of Stone Town. And then we have... Uh, Oh, the last thing we were looking at was this floating bar restaurant. That looks so cool with all the flags. Zenji Garden Cafe. And so family, this is where we were at earlier. The, the Old Fort and uh, the House of Wonders. Hey child, what are you doing? You turn everything into a, a toy or a game, right? That's why you have that fancy, expensive phone so you can do, do something with it. So, so Papa, you remember that toy? You know what that toy? You know what that toy? You remember? They're saying you're being too hard on your bargaining skills. They, well, they're basically saying that you're not in Ghana, so you can't be trying to bargain oh, us down. Wow. Who said that? Him. He said that. Yeah, I'm reading his lips. <laughs> I'm laughing, on my next trip. Method man. That's why I keep tell me about it. It's made in China size. Not everybody got a Bruce Lee body. And all of them are not small. You squeeze in, look all funny. A lot of people squeeze and stuff, don't make the shape. You know, that's the, that's the latest thing nowadays, everything tight. Yeah, yeah, yeah absolutely. So, so fam, we're going to break on this. Uh, we're going to get ready for the rain to clear and we're going to continue showing you more of uh, the ocean side of Stone Town. And we're going to take a break and watch Akubi shop and uh, basically um, get the best deal. Right. You just you, you have already won a shopping award already. Akuvi gonna oh, do I'm the man down. 